Hello. It's time for Splatoon. It's Splatoon in time. That's right. That's right. This is what you're all here for. Super Platoon. Yes, the Splatoon that is super. Welcome, Denchi, Hamflow, and Slime Molder. We're gonna do some Salmon Run. Also, welcome, Duck. Do some Salmon Run, and then we'll do some... Some not Salmon Run. Some other multiplayer. Anyway, I'm gonna... I, I think my internet is better today. Um... It's probably not actually the case. We'll find out. Probably like in an hour from now, it'll turn red repeatedly. And then I'll be like, oh man, I thought my internet was good. But it's not. It'll never be good ever again. Don't jinx it. It's too late. It's too late. I've already done it. Jinxing it. Look, if I don't, if I don't say anything, then, then I don't know. But if I do say something, then it could be... it's totally just my fault. Okay. What if I just don't acknowledge it? I could just not acknowledge it. It's true. Uh, I set my bitrate to 4,000... Oh shoot, I almost just fell off. 4,000 kilobits per second. And... Uh, because this game has a lot more frames, you know, than Mario could cross. Hopefully that's good enough. It's still 30 FPS, which may not actually be enough for Splatoon. Um, I don't even have an egg. Why did I go back to base? <laughs> so, if it looks framey, it's because, you know, it's at 30. Oh no. <laughs> we, got, we got things. Uh, everyone's dying. It has the same amount of frames. Maybe it's not really that noticeable. Maybe it's fine. Maybe it's totally fine. I'm gonna use my special. I all I just fell off. I literally just used my special and then I fell off. Look at that. Unbelievable. This guy's just falling off all the time. I probably didn't need to use my special there. Yeah, L plus ratio. R plus ratio. Horatio Sands. That's a guy, right? That's a guy from... From, uh... What was that? <laughs> Saturday Night Lives. Wasn't there, wasn't there a Horatio? An SNL? I feel like there was. Anyway. It's Saturday. You guys having a fun Saturday? Enjoying your Saturday. Everyone? Oh no. Oh no. Look at all these enemies. It's not a real name. It is. It is. It's totally a real name for real. No cap. I should have been focusing on this guy. I used my special. We have eggs. Oh no, I got destroyed. Pretty good Saturday. What did you guys do today? What's going on with you guys? I did nothing today. Um, I watched some uh, some streams. That's basically all I did. Just watching streams. Oh no, they got ink all over the place. Yeah, Twitch, same. Yo, who can relate? Me, I can relate. I watched some... Uh, why did I go in there? <laughs> I watched some uh, Vesper. Vesper was doing his 24 hour Twitch stream. And I tuned in for part of it. And then Becco was setting up Minecraft. She wasn't even playing Minecraft, she was just setting things up. Oh, why did I go in there? <laughs> That's it. And now we're here. I was thinking of uh, programming some, some VTube Studio Rust library, handling events and stuff like that. Ended up being more complicated than I thought due to the way I set up the retry logic. 
It's handled internally, and then everything assumes a request and response structure. But then you get things that are not responses to requests. They just show up as events. And so I had to be like, hmm, how the heck am I going to do this? I don't know yet. One day I'll figure it out, but that day might not be today. What the? Read a book? What the heck? People out here reading books? Uh, I'm gonna die. <laughs> what book did you read? What kind of books do people read nowadays? People out here reading things? That's everyone's favorite book. Oh no, no. <laughs> Harry Potter. No, Harry Potter. That book is so old. Look, I stole it. <laughs> I just. I just threw the egg. Well, I didn't know these things could fall off. L plus ratio plus fell off. Anna Karenina? That's like three names combined. Anna, Karen, and Nina? Oh. Is it about someone named Aaron? Aaron? Sorry. <laughs> I combined Anna and Karen. You know, so imagine it was about someone named Aaron. Can't stop me, I can't read. I can read. Look, I'm reading your comments right now. How is this guy still alive? Okay. That's cool. I haven't dropped any frames. That's a good sign, right? I've dropped zero frames. Yeah, yeah. We got to round three at least. Yeah, that guy up there did 22 egg carries. This guy literally carrying us. We got an egg. Anyway, what happened was, I was watching Vesper stream, and then he raided into Altair, who was also streaming on Twitch. But he was he was streaming League of Legends, so uh, I closed the stream because I don't want to watch that. Did I read it in Russian? Oh, the Anna Karenina? I don't know. I don't know. Imagine watching League of Legends SMH. Never. I would never watch League of Legends. You see me watching League of Legends, I'm there against my own will. If you see if you see me watching, be like, what's wrong? Something's wrong here. It's not this is not who I this is not the Wolfie I know. He would never willingly watch League of Legends. So it's a it's a it's a cry for help. Okay, look at this. We're blasting. Literally blast in all these enemies. Destroy this man. Yeah, destroy him. He's dead. Please help. No. I think the worst part is, I think, um... Like, Altair was planning on streaming, like, five hours of, like, Teamfight Tactics and then five hours of League of Legends or something. And apparently the people he collabed with just decided to play League of Legends instead. So he's going to be playing 10 hours of League of Legends. Isn't that, isn't that awful? <laughs> Doesn't that sound awful? I don't know. What's up, what's up with that game? It's like, it's very popular. That's like four matches. I don't know how long a League of Legends game is. Isn't team tight team tight team tight tac <laughs> team, team fight oh shoot team fight tactics? Isn't that just uh Isn't that the same thing as League of Legends? It's like by the same people or something. Yeah, ten hours. That's too that's too many hours. That's ten hours too many. 45 minutes? Oh, that's a long time. 45 minutes? Dota is the one with the really long matches. Yeah, I guess that's what I meant by it's the same 
It's the same as League of Legends. It's the same characters. It's by the same people. It's like how Dota had like auto chess or something. And then it became its own game series. Auto battlers. I don't know. The only the only all about battle battler I played is Super Auto Pets. You know that game. That's a good game. Although I haven't played it in a very long time. Oh no! This guy's stealing our eggs. <clears throat> okay. Okay. This is this is fine. I throw. Throw a bomb. I should have waited to throw the bomb. No, this guy's gonna have him eat the eat the bomb, and then he he didn't. Okay, eat the bomb. The bomb has been eaten. Get this get this guy out of here. Why do I have no ink? No, I definitely have ink. Oh. We're making good progress here. Oops. It's a lot of it's a lot of green ink. A lot of green ink on the floor. Uh everyone's dying. <laughs> everyone's dead. Okay, I'm gonna use my special. And we're gonna fail. We're we're dead. We're dead. Oh we met it. We met the goal. Oh okay, never mind. We almost did it. We almost did it. We even had AJ the DJ on our team. How could we fail with this guy? What's up? What's up with this guy? No, I feel like my team carried me there. <laughs> they only did eight egg carries. Yeah, the two hundred sixty-fifth DJ. What happened to the other ones? I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna rejoin a different team. Let's go. I don't know what I'm gonna do after this stream. Actually, no, Karagi's streaming earlier today, right? I guess this whole day is just gonna be me watching streams and streaming. This is my life now. I'm just gonna be streaming and watching streams. And then, like, just sometimes watching YouTube videos. Whatever the algorithm recommends to me. Living the dream. Yeah, the stream. Living the stream, literally. The dream stream. Any good YouTube videos? Um... What have I been watching recently? I don't know, I just get, I just get like, a lot of food video recommendations. Those are pretty nice. There's one of like YouTube. It's mostly YouTube shorts nowadays. So you got people. Uh, there's some channels that are like, look at this weird thing in Japan. It's like it's got the like TikTok uh, <laughs> text to speech stuff. So it's like, oh look, we got a restaurant where you can buy. Uh, instead of paying with money, you pay with rubber ducks. Isn't that wacky? Oh look at Japan. Stuff like that. Yeah, there is a restaurant in Japan where instead of paying with money, you pay with the rubber ducks. And if you don't have rubber ducks, you can buy the ducks with money. And so you're basically paying money with like an extra step in between. But it's so wacky. It's so wacky though. Can you imagine paying with rubber ducks? Truly revolutionary. We are totally going to fail. <laughs> it's so quirky, right? It's so wacky. Whoa, in Japan, you can buy cigarettes in vending machines. Whoa, what? Oh, no, look at that. There's a video of, like, they were selling, like, fish broth or something. It looked like a drink. They had it in a bottle. It's like, oh, look at, look at this, guys. You can buy fish broth. In Japan, in summer, it's really hot, and so you lose a lot of, uh, sweat, and you lose a lot of sodium. 
And so look at this thing right here. They're selling fish broth. There's like a live fish in it. Well, it's not a live fish. It's like a dead fish. But like, there's an actual fish in the broth, in the bottle. And then the guy takes a drink of it and he's like, wow, this is so salty. And then the guy, someone in the comments was like, uh, hey, just, just so you know, that sign on the bottom of the vending machine says, please don't drink this. This is meant to be cooked with like other stuff. <laughs> Like, oh, okay, cool. Just, just out there, just drinking the fish broth. Wow, it's so salty, guys. Yo, thank you for the seven months, Namai. Seven months. That's a lot of months. Yeah, so many months though. That's like almost a year if you round up and then you add two. So close. Okay, we got- No one's inking the walls! What you do here is you gotta ink the walls. Oh, everyone's on top of this. Yeah, you ever think about how there's so many months? There's 12 months. I feel like there should be 10. There should have been 10 months. None of this 12 month nonsense. Get this guy out of here. This guy shooting his lasers. Okay, okay. Oh uh, no, I'm gonna die. Never mind. Almost like time. No, time is real. You keep saying time's not real. But it totally is real. We are experiencing it right now, even. Oh, uh, look. Oh, look at this guy. Did the pro strat. Of getting the boss to destroy the other boss. I jumped, I jumped the wrong way. I tried to jump. There are no numbers in the sky. Look, isn't this what, um, sundials are? The sun is dialing. Okay, get this guy, get this guy. Oh no, we, we did it. That's fine. Okay, throw, <laughs> throw a bomb. <clears throat> Have you tried staring at the sun though? What if the numbers are on the sun? Actually, I don't recommend doing that. Don't do that. Don't do that. What is the sun dialing? The time. The time. I like how Denchi knows that it's 911, even though I'm sure in Germany the emergency number is not 911. So everything is so Americanized. You have to normalize your dialogue to <laughs> to talk about. As if so that Americans understand it. Isn't that messed up? Society is so based on America. You don't even know what it is in <laughs> so you, you know the emergency number in America, but not Germany. Isn't that messed up? That's so messed up. You should- you could look it up. You should look it up. Yeah, what if you have an emergency? And you don't even- you won't know what to call. Yeah, try calling right now. Sorry, I'm just testing. This is just a test. They'll forgive you. I just threw an egg <laughs> into- I pressed the wrong button there. I threw an egg in the wrong direction. Oops. Someone has to pick up. Imagine if you call and no one picks up. I would be scared. Be like, oh shoot. Have you ever been like on an elevator and they have like the emergency button that you can press? I think one time I was like in an elevator at school. I am throwing the egg in the wrong direction. Um, and I think either someone pressed the button by mistake, or I don't know, it just somehow came up. Uh, the person on the other end was like, Hello, someone pressed the emergency button? A anything, everything good there? And then no one spoke up. We're, we're just all like looking at each other, just staring. I'm, I'm sure someone should have said no, but. We just all looked at each other in silence, and no one said anything. And then we all left the we all left the elevator. 
I don't know if maybe they sent over some people. Because like, what if what if you get an emergency call, and no one picks up, right? You kind of have to assume that there's like an actual emergency. So maybe maybe they sent some people over, but I simply don't know. Yeah, what's your emergency? Yeah, just check in. You guys are there. Just want to make sure. Just want to make sure it's working. Like, what if you call and then it's not working? They do have things like that in, like, old people's homes. Old elderly care centers or whatever. Like, for, for those, they typically have, like, a thing where there's a cord that you can pull. Like, if someone falls down, right, they need to somehow be able to call for help. And so there's a, there's a cord you can pull. But... They they frequently have to verify that it actually works, and so they recommend like every few months just pulling it and be like, "Sir, we're just testing," because you don't want it to not work when you actually need it to. Also, uh, this is a lot of enemies right here. <laughs> yeah, uh, I tried to use my special. What do you? What if you have an axe murderer and you can't talk? Yeah, there's been there's been stuff like that. Well, not, not for me specifically, but like, <laughs> the stuff that I have seen via YouTube. Where I think, um, I think I got like a YouTube recommendation once. Where someone called 911 and asked to order a pizza. And that was like a code word for like, no, it was like for domestic violence or something. Like instead of saying, please send over the police or whatever, they had to code it and they, they had to say like, Yes, I'd like to order a pizza. Yeah, that story. And then the person on the other line is like, "You're calling 911 to order a pizza? Are you okay?" It's like, "Yeah, yeah, I'd like, I'd like a pizza. Please send uh, two large pizzas to this address." And then, uh, thankfully, the person on the other side understood what was going on. I remember. Yeah, you guys remember? I saw that. Classic stream. When we say, I remember. This is when the streamer says something and you say, I remember that. I was watching another stream the other day. And it was, um... Just like a nostalgia stream. Like, remember in the 90s when they had these things? That was a whole stream. It's like, you remember this thing? Oh yeah, I remember that. <laughs> you guys remember this thing from the 90s? Oh yeah, totally, I remember that. And then chat was just saying things like, hey, remember this thing? I've done that before. I've, I've done this. Wait, I'm not even queued up. Yo, you guys remember remember Neopets? Whoa. I remember Neopets. Yeah, that's wild, but remember remember Digivices? Yo. Yo, I remember. <laughs> I remember those. Yeah, but that's nothing. You remember those, those things where there's like a fish and there's a magnet and then you... You do the little fishing thing on the magnets and the fish, you catch the fish, yo! And then the thing where there's like things suspended in the water and there's rings and you press the thing and then it, it shoots the rings up. You try to get the rings on the thing. Welcome, Dororin. Welcome to Splatoon. I also recall when folks on Tumblr tried to pass off a whole system that different pizza ingredients meant different things. <laughs> You tell me people are just making things up. No. Obviously the, the police know specific ingredient combinations. Snailians? I don't know what that is. <laughs> what is a snailian? Are snailians real? I have no idea. Ah, oh, no. Just got destroyed. Oh, okay, 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 there's things happening. Here, get the, get this guy. I got this guy. Oop. Okay, there's a lot of enemies right here. I would recommend getting these enemies. 
but I have no ink. So we are one egg short. Bobby's world? I don't remember that at all. Is that like Wayne's world? What, do you guys remember Wayne's world? I've actually never watched Wayne's world. I did watch Gwayne's world though. Remember Gwayne's world from uh, the educational TV show on PBS? Between the Lions? That was a good show. It's an educational show where there's like two lion puppets and they they would talk about things. Educational things. It was like a variety show. Yeah, between the lions. It's a pun. I don't know if you guys understand this. It's a pun. It's like between the lions, except instead of lions. It's lions. Sorry, the other way around. Yeah, there was a lion family. There's like a brother lion, a sister lion. It's got all kinds of lions. And then they had like a lady. There were some live action segments. Anyway, cool show. I would recommend watching it if you are a child and you need to understand grammar and, and things like that. Or maybe if you're not a child. Maybe if you just feel like looking at things. If you want a show to watch, that is one of them. That's one of the shows you could watch. But you don't have to. I'm just saying, if you want to. It's like, hmm. There's not enough streams to watch. Instead of watching the stream, I'll watch this... This children's show. Okay, I will help you. Okay, I didn't help you. I have been destroyed. Yeah, I don't remember Bobby's world. What is Bobby's world? This is just Bobby's world and we're living in it. Yeah, now I need the help. The show with Bobby. Yo, Bobby from uh, King of the Hill. Bobby from XKCD. Build Bobby Tables. Robert Tables, as they call him. Known for dropping tables with his sequel injection techniques. Okay, shoot at this guy. Look at all these eggs. Oh no. <laughs> Ah, uh, shoot. Hosted by Howie Mandel. Wait, what is- is this an actual show that people watched? The only thing I know about Howie Mandel is like... Uh... He was on Deal or No Deal? He was on like, America's Got Talent or something. The Mandel Effect. It's always been the Mandel Effect. People think it's about Nelson Mandela. It's actually always been about Howie Mandel. How is he so Mandel? Get it? Howie? <laughs> How he Mandel? That that's that's his name. That has always been his name. That's what the Mandel effect is. You think it was Howie? No, it's How he Mandel. We're about to die. Oh no. <laughs> That pun is criminal. It's not even a pun. That's his actual name. Yeah, how can he even be Mandel? This guy. This man. This man Dell right here. This man, he Dell. Like Adele. You guys remember Adele? Is she still... she still makes music? What is what is the most recent Adele song? Gregor Mendel? I don't. Who's that? Is that a guy from history? Is he an MMA guy? 
Gregory. Is it Gregor, Mc, McGregor? Isn't there a guy named McGregor who does uh, MMA stuff? Howie McGregor? The Howie and the Dell, the Howie and the Dell. What? How can he even Dell? Gregor Mandel was the pea plant. What? The pea plant today? What is that? What is that? I have no idea what that is. How can one man so much Dell? Dude, you got a Dell. <laughs> My computer just crashed. Okay, never mind. <laughs> you might have not heard sound for a while. And then it's back. No, I didn't hear sound. You guys, you guys heard fine. I didn't hear sound for a while. The loopback monitoring device stopped working. His full name is Gregor Mandel. Oh, you also lost that. Okay, it definitely is me then. It's totally my fault. My computer crashed. Not my computer crashed. That, that would suck. A program on my computer that was routing the audio. It crashed. Okay, there's a lot of- <laughs> there's a lot of things happening here. Good thing I have the burst weapon. I have no ink. I have no ink. We didn't hear sound either. Imagine if like we all just stopped hearing like at the same time. Just all of us at the same time. There was one time when I uh, was speaking of elevators. There was one time when I was in an elevator with someone else and uh the lights flashed like the, the lights stopped for like maybe like half a second. And I, th I thought I just blinked, right? I've told this story before. I thought I just blinked. And it's like, oh, of course, of course the lights would go out. Because, you know, my eyes have been closed for like, you know, a fraction of a second. Um, so I said nothing. But then the, the guy next to me was like, hey, did you like, did the lights go out for a second? And it's like, oh, sorry. I, I thought I just blinked, sorry. And that's it. That's, that's the whole story. Wow, that's such an interesting story, Wolfie. Thanks for telling us. That's it. That's all. That's all it was. The elevator was fine. I should probably be shooting the uh, the golden egg guy. Welcome, Chaos Ryan. I'm just here. Yeah. Wow. Interesting story, streamer. I love your stories. They're the best stories I have ever heard. The quality of these anecdotes is so high. You can never watch another streamer ever again because they, they do not have high quality anecdotes such as these. They just talk about boring things such as video games and AI generated art and Things that they did as children. Yo, wave two. Yeah, remember when they stored the ease? Remember when the anecdotes? Welcome, Nano Dan. Oh, we have to go down here. You gotta go down here. Here's a pro tip: when you see the water level is low, you have to go down here. Because otherwise, if you're up there. There's nothing there. All the enemies are down here. I can't see anything. <laughs> Good luck on wave 3. Niji Sanji, wave 3. Etheria? What was, what was her name? Etheria? Uh, everyone's dead. I'm- I'm the only one alive? Okay, never mind. Uh, 
They only talk about the things 90s kids will remember. Skip. Oh, I remember Skip it. You guys remember Skip it? <laughs> it's like Bop it, except you skip. Can't wait for the next wave of Niji Ian. It's like every three months, I feel like. When when did the last wave come out? Two months ago? It's gonna be a month. I know because I'm I'm a mod in, in Pomo's chat. That's that's how I know. Yeah, they tell me they tell me all the important information and I'm here leaking it to the public. I'm kidding. That's a joke by the way, they don't tell me anything. Because I'm not actually employed by any corporation related to VTubers. Yeah, no ults. Yeah, I just don't even use my ultimates. Also, yes, this is co-op PvE. For people unfamiliar with Splatoon, you just fight waves of enemies. Yeah, saving those ult Look, I literally... They're not even called ults. They're called specials or supers. No, they're called specials. Up. I'm just up here. What if I need them for the next game? Where's the bosses? Where are the, where are the bosses at? They're only special if you use- no, if you don't use them, they're still there. Oop. I could have gotten this guy. I helped though, somehow. I tried to save an old- no, because if you if you finish round three, no matter how many specials you had in the previous three rounds, you always have exactly one special to use. So in round three, if you still have specials left, you definitely should use them. There's no reason not to. Pro tip. Pro tip. Um, everyone's dead. <laughs> everyone's dead. We probably shouldn't have uh, grouped up like that. Nope. Well. Hey. Get over here. What is, oh, he's out of ink. No, he's... Or he disconnected? He just gave up. He disconnected. I think he disconnected. I disconnected? Am I disconnected? <laughs> What's going on? What's happening? What? <laughs> what? I think, the, yeah, the last remaining player just disconnected. Okay, that's cool. Nice, very nice. So welcome, Kuzip. That was weird. That was, that was very strange. No, he's got, we don't even know his name. They don't even show, they, he just got yeeted. Is that, is that a thing people still say? Got yeeted. Yote. The past tense of yeeted. Yoted. Yote. You can't blame me because I had the charge. Uh, you can blame me. You probably should. I'm usually the worst player on the team. See, this is how I'm different from other streamers. They get mad because their team is bad. Oh, I just made a rhyme. Uh, but I get. I don't get mad because usually I'm the one on the team. That's the worst. And so I have no excuses. I can't be like, oh, my teammate, they're so bad. They should have done this thing. They should have done this. Usually it's probably if you can, if someone was streaming and I was in their game, they would probably be saying that about me. And that's fine. It's fine because I'm just here to talk. You tune into these other streamers and they're like, oh, freaking this Wolfie guy. Mm -hmm. He doesn't even know how to, doesn't even know how to shoot things. I'm just here like, you guys remember Boppets? Wow, you guys, those are, those are some things. Those are some concepts from the 90s. You guys remember Yakback? It's like a, <laughs> you could record stuff and play it back. I had one of those. I like how I said, haha, look at these other streamers. They just have a whole stream where they just say, remember this thing? And then I'm just doing the same thing. This is the meta though. This is the metaverse. Just me saying things. 
Yeah, you could bop it and twist it. Yakaback. They also had they had the yakaback. And they had the yak backwards. It's like the yak, except you could also play audio in reverse. Whoa. Streamer I watched named himself Scapegoat. Is he the goat? Is he goaded? Truly a goaded move. Oh no, look. They're shooting at us. Uh, okay, this is- that's bad. That vine of the guy imitating a bop it? I don't remember that. It sounds like it, it would be a TikTok also. What makes something a vine instead of a TikTok? The platform on which it was recorded and uploaded? I think so. That would make sense. That's, that's YouTube. That's not Vine. You're telling me people re-upload Vines to YouTube? I can't believe this. But unfortunately, I can't click that right now. Maybe when I'm done with this. I'll look at the video and we'll be like, ha, huh, that was funny. <clears throat> I do remember when people did it for the Vine, though. Now they do it for the vine sauce. The Vincent vine sauce. Oh no, I fell off. This guy fell off. Every time. Literally every time I fall off. Always L plus ratio. Remember... Remember L? From... Death Note. Whoa, hey, this guy. Oh, you gotta get this guy. Gotta get this. I should not be here. <laughs> this was bad. I feel like I'm not helping my team. They're probably yelling about it on voice chat. Hate this guy. Hate this Wolfie guy. How can he- he just fell off. He literally just he wasn't even killed by an enemy. He just fell off. That's what I like to tell myself. I am somehow helping my team. Okay, here we go. I can't see anything. <laughs> I cannot see anything right there. Oh no, no, we're gonna run out. Yeah, let me put the egg, put the egg in the basket. Oh, we almost got it. We had like 18 out of 20. 17? Okay, that's close enough. Remember when people did it not for honor, but for- Yeah, Snake Eater? Yo, Snake Eater. Snake Eater reference. So, welcome Deafens. Did I say welcome Deafens? Is this your first message in chat? I don't know. Your, your name is Green. We got so many people with the green names. Nano Dan, Toaster, Denchi, Deffens. I never welcome Toaster. Okay, hey, Toaster is Toaster. Is that the Toaster? <laughs> I do this every time. Every time. This is the real Toaster. Oh, that, is that a new emote? Trog? Nano de Trog? Oh wait, I can click the video now. Hold on, hold on. What was that video? Hamflow posted this video. Wait a second, why... Why is the audio played through... It's not played through my headset. It's playing from my speakers. Strange. Oh, there he is. He's got the game developer badge. You don't have to do this every time. You don't have to put on your badge. We know. We know it's you. It's just a bit. Just a funny thing we do here. On the Wolfie Wolfington channel. Got him. 
Oh no, I should not have jumped in here. Somehow I got out of that. Well, real game dev. The dev in chat. <clears throat> I got recommended a video today of like... Um... Games made in Godot recently. One of them was like a whole live fan game. I was like, whoa, I wasn't expecting to see a VTuber game in this video. This official Godot uploaded video. Okay, get this guy, get this guy. Oops. Nano is the true green. Is he though? What makes his green more true than the other greens? Is it because he built his whole identity around being green? No. <laughs> oh, I haven't seen that one yet. Get all of his cool emotes. Welcome, Yogi King. Okay, one of these days we'll finish wave three. I only carried three eggs, come on. A dark green. It is a different shade of green. They're all they're all very similar though. They're like kind of the same, but not really. Just slightly. What's what's everyone's favorite hex code? For colors. I like how uh, in Niji Sanji they have official hex color codes and they do these in their intro screens or intro videos, whatever. What are they called? The debut streams? Hello, this is me. My official hex code color. And then they say the six, uh, six hexadecimals. Yeah, it is cool. Have you ever wondered? Just go to their go to their debut streams. It's probably also on the wiki. The Wikipedia. The VTuber wiki. Sorry, the VTuber fandom. Actually, it's probably a wiki. I think they have their own wiki. Is that just a light view? Telling me this guy can't read hex codes and determine what color they are automatically. Yeah, same age. Shoot this thing, shoot. There's no reason for me to do that, right? <laughs> yeah, I knew it obviously is blue for real. Whoa, hey, everyone here is dying. That is his official brand color. Sometimes brands change their color. It's always weird. It's like, wait a second, they changed the shade of blue. It's like slightly different from what it used to be. Change their logo all the time. When the brand changes their logo to be like minimalistic and one color. The, the Pringles guy. They got rid of the shading on his his mustache. Now he's just like he's just a guy. Taco Bell. I've actually never been to a Taco Bell. I know Taco Bell is a beloved brand, but I cannot relate. I've never been there. They had, uh, they, they opened Taco Bell in Japan, like, in the past few years. Everyone was like, yo, finally. Now you can get fake Mexican food in Japan. American Americanized Mex Mexican food in Japan. Tex-Mex. No, it's, it's like its own genre. a good color. It is, it is a good shade of blue. If I were to name my favorite shades of blue, 
that. I don't know. That could be one of them. I don't know. I had not thought about this until just now. And we are gaming. Get the egg. Get the egg. Okay, he got the egg. Welcome, Raibuka. Yeah, we do be wooming. I saw like Niji Sanji is having like a tournament for Splatoon or something. Uh, it's between like the Japanese and all the other branches. And uh, in some of the the, the English <laughs> the English players' uh, intros, they all said Wumi, and all the Japanese players were like, "What is Wumi?" They had no idea. They just kept questioning. They saw it once and they're like, "Oh, that's funny. That's just a sound." And then it kept, yeah, it kept coming up and like, what the, what the heck is Wumi? Why is everyone saying Wumi? Hopefully someone told them. They didn't include that in the clips. What are they Wumi about? Here, you get, you can be alive. Oops. They are. What do they say in Japan that's not Wumi? <laughs> I don't know. They probably have an equivalent. There's no way they don't. Oh yeah, one other thing I noticed. I was watching- wait, I, I'm pretty sure I've talked about this before. But like... I've gotten some recommendations on YouTube about... Um... Japanese players playing Salmon Run and stuff like that. They're usually pretty good. They're, they're like really good. But then, one thing I noticed is that a lot of times they use a lot of English words in the Japanese version. But then they're like, they're not the same as the English words that, that are used in the English version of Splatoon. I feel like my ability to talk is like hindered today for some reason. Like it's not as clear as it could be. But... Yeah, instead of like, you know how um, in Splatoon we say Booyah? If you press like the bottom bottom button, they say Booyah. In, in Japanese, it just says nice. Like Naisu. And uh, when you complete a round, it says GJ for good job. Stuff like that. And... It's like, it's very English. They got a lot of English. Oh. No, thank you for the raid, Hexadigital. How are you guys doing? I could shout you out, but actually I can't because I'm playing right now. But eventually, I will shout you out. <laughs> Once we get past this wave, okay, I'm gonna, gonna throw the eggs. Is this the first time we can, we can win? Look at that, look at that! Welcome raiders. The Booyah Bomb is a nice bomb. I actually don't know what they call it in Japanese. Nice ball? Guild Wars 2? What the? <laughs> That's a game I've never played. But I know it was very popular back in the day. Okay, I'm gonna do a shout out. Nice ball. <laughs> Yeah, Guild Wars 2. I'm gonna- I'm gonna do the official shout-out. There it is. Built into Twitch.tv. Whoa, this guy carried 36 eggs. <laughs> wow. Good look at that guy. He's too good. Okay, we've done all the salmon run we need to. Now we can play some regular multiplayer. Yeah, I always forget Twitch has it. It's like, it's not even useful. It doesn't tell you what they were doing. It's just like, here they are, join us in following this person. And there's like no context. It's like, what, <laughs> it's like what, what, what is this? What were they doing? Tell me something about them. It's just like, here they are, here's their name. Here's their, their user icon. And that's it. That's all. That's all they do. Okay, we got glasses. We got more glasses. 
got money. Oh yeah, it does, it does tell them that they were shouted out though. That's pretty cool. Yeah, join join us. Toaster used to play Guild Wars too. Hog, Hoggers. Twitch added the shout out features two days after I made one of my channel. And both inputs are different. Okay, we're gonna play some ranked. Oh, clam blitz? No, no. Tower control. Here we go. Yeah, it tells you someone shouted you out. And to how many people. Yeah, bow special. Yeah, I use this weapon because it requires no skill. I, I mention this every time. <laughs> I'm, I'm bad at this game, so I use the, the baby weapon. Just spam specials all the time. Welcome, Uto. The funny bow. This guy with the bow. Okay, look at this. I don't need to learn how to play the game. I just need to. I just need to. <laughs> I just need a paint. Biggest pet peeve is that there's a long delay to shout someone again. Oh, there's a cooldown. I didn't know that. I guess I've never shouted out more than one person at a time. Bowser. Bowser. Oh, look at that communication. How could they do this? I should hydrate. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, that's Splatoon. It's Splatoon. Okay, I'm gonna shout out, um... Shout out myself. I cannot... Okay, I can't shout out myself. They thought of everything. Man. Let me shout out... Um... Who can I shout out? What's a, what's a random person I can shout out? Nintendo? Yeah, Nintendo? Yo, it's Nintendo. Yeah, Nintendo's gonna check out their their logs and be like, Wolfie shouted, what the heck, Wolfie? Welcome, Pepito. The, what, is that the real, <laughs> yeah, Nintendo's gonna come in here? Yo, thanks for the shout out, I was just, we were, I was talking about you the other day. You're playing Splatoon. Oh, hey, well, that's a game, that's, they're the developers of this game. Here, look. Look, I'm not helping my team at all. I'm just painting. I'm spamming my special. Look, I, I did I did two kills right there. <laughs> I'm helping. I actually helped more than anyone else. Uh, no, get me out of get me out of here. Use my special. There's one guy. There's two guys. There's nothing- okay, I guess I'll use it on one guy. Shout out Uwu to Uwu. No. We're winning. It's all thanks to my help. I helped us. With my special spam. Check that out. Check this out. We're already past checkpoint two. This is not toxic. It's how they built the game around this. It's built into the game. I'm begging you to make Walter smile a sub emote. But think of all the non-subs. Think of all the followers. They should really make follower emotes usable by subs as well on other channels. It just feels weird. You have to like choose, just like, oh, with some of these, you know, you can't use them. Oh no, get me out of here, <laughs> get me out of here. For real, for reals. Just one oh, no, don't shoot at me, don't shoot at me, I'm just a guy. 
You can upload it as an emote twice. Yeah, but then you're using like two emote slots. It's so strong. Okay, maybe... Wh what would I remove for it though? The other ones are like fairly used. Also, I'm playing this like Turf War. I'm not like using... <laughs> I don't even know where the objective is. I'm just painting. And then occasionally using my special. I know some people use the follower emotes. Oops. That are not inside jokes. More... what? <laughs> okay. Yeah, sus. Everyone loves all the emotes. They're too good, that's the problem. They're too good. <clears throat> I should make bad emotes so that... Uh, there's no question about which ones are good. Oops. I somehow got that guy? Okay. Look at me. I'm helping out. Swap smile with think- Oh yeah, the thinking emote isn't used that often. Sunglasses is also useless. That's more like a filler emote. I also haven't added any like bit emotes, right? We have a thing where like if you cheer 1000 bits you get a you get an emote forever. But I don't know what to put for that one. So instead if you if you donate you get nothing. Smile is goaded. Okay, maybe I'll demote smile. Sorry, I'll demote the uh that one. Good. We had this conversation. This is a democracy after all. A democracy, but I make the final call. So is it really a democracy? Not really. Oh no, stop chasing me. Stop chasing me. <laughs> okay, here we are. Here we are. Where's everyone? We did. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna use it right now. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna change the settings. Literally right now. Okay, viewer rewards. Emotes. Okay, we're gonna take out the, um, blah, blah, blah. which one? I think, I think, okay, you're gonna be, switch this out with, I have to remove it. Okay, I have to remove it. It's been removed. Smile, remove from slot. Now we're gonna add smile. Um, it's not working. How do we? How do we choose it? Oh no! Now there's no emote there. Oh wait, there. Okay, click this thing. Tier one. Okay, it's been added. And then the thinking one. This one will become a follower emote. Okay, there. Now you can use it. Now you can use it. Cash for bits emotes. Yeah, maybe I should make one with, like, cash. Also, welcome... Fueda... Socks. Welcome. And also, Mooneybug. It's a wolfocracy. Yeah, but now think of all the non-subs that can't use the smile emote. What if that was their favorite follower emote? You know, I think I feel like what like the the heart emote might work better as a follower emote as well. See, it's me, your go. I can't believe that. What if what if it's not? What if it's not? Actually, I I assumed it was you because you're a mod for for Frida Nox. The heart emote is good? Okay, I, I don't know. Wait, I'm not even queued up for a match. I'm just... <laughs> I'm just doing nothing. Now we can't be happy anymore? Yeah, you can... you cannot smile anymore. Just farm emotes? Oh yeah, that's right. It only costs 80. You got people with like 200k points. Oh, look, Potato Games doesn't have it now. I need more emote slots. 
You can only get more slots if you become a, a partner. Th those requirements are very far off. No, the Karagi pain. Okay, this time, this time we're gonna win. No, wait, we, we won last time. I like, I wasn't even paying attention at all to what I was doing. That's what happens with this weapon. You just... You just shoot. You just spam your special. Don't even go on the objective, like, at all. Look at that. I could have gotten all four of them. But I chose not to. For speed reasons. Oh, no, he got me. He hates followers. No, no. No. Streamer would never hate followers. They only hate the bots that require them to purchase followers. They're not require. The bots that request you to purchase followers from their website. From their totally legitimate website. Okay, oh no, they're getting me. They're here, they're here. <laughs> Top Keck? Yo, that's a, that's a, that's a thing. Thank you for the Prime sub, Papato Games. Is that THE Papato Games? The guy who does clips of independent VTubers? That's the guy, that's the guy. The guy whose name is pronounced like Potato. But people say Papato. That's the that's the guy. That's him. That's him, John Papeto. I pronounce Papeto different ways and none of them are like how I what? Is I literally say like potato, but like but differently. Papeto. That's him, Papeto. Potato crisps. Yo, thank you for the raid. What the? That's a lot of people. Thank you for the raid, Sasha. What were you doing? I unfortunately cannot shout you out right now. Because I'm... I'm in an intense battle. Okay, now I can shout you out. <laughs> uh... You were doing... Yellow Zelda. That's a game. That's a, that's a Zelda game I've never played. That's the one on the, the DS, right? Or the 3DS? Wait, I have a special I should be using. Um, okay, here's, here's two of them. Yeah, 3DS. Is that a good game? That's the one with, like, low rule, right? They have high rule. Like, if high if high rule is so good, why is there no rule? <laughs> low rule. I mean, there is. They literally added it. It's very good? Okay. That's good to know. I think my 3DS is dead, though. So even if I wanted to play it... I mean, I guess I could emulate it. But no, no, I would never. We're just gonna <laughs> okay, let me use my special. <clears throat> Citra... No, who... Yeah, never... <laughs> Unofficial, not not endorsed. I would never I would never do such a thing. Oh no, okay, I'm dead. <clears throat> anyway, good to know. Hopefully it was a good stream. I actually don't emulate, to to be fair. <laughs> Unless it's like officially on the Nintendo, like their official emulator on the Switch. I have not emulated in quite a long time. I remember when I was in like middle school, one of my one of my classmates or something, <laughs> he just gave me like a CD-ROM. That was my first the first time I've heard of emulation. One of my classmates just gave me like a CD-ROM. It had like all these Game Boy Advance games on them. He's like, "What is? It? You can play Game Boy Advance games like on your computer? What?" It had like the what was that Virtual Boy? 
or something. I don't know. Hypothetically speaking, of course, I didn't do it. Someone gave it to me. I had no, I had no call on this. It's always morally correct. Oh, he just gave it to me. And Mega Man Battle Network. Look, I know Mega Man. Visual boy, yeah, visual. What is it? What is a virtual boy? Was that the was that the other Nintendo console, Virtual Boy? The one that's like it's all red. I don't get in trouble. Oh yeah, those <laughs> Nintendo banned their accounts. Have a good dinner. Thank you for the raid. Android phones allow you to play Game Boy games. Yeah, there's probably emulators for everything. The Virtual Boy. The first game I emulated was Pokemon Gold Translated. Oh. I remember when I was in either elementary school or middle school, someone like in my summer class had like a... That's like before Pokemon Gold was released officially. I think it might have been the same game you're talking about. It's like someone unofficially translated it. But then someone had it like on an actual like cartridge. And they brought it to school. They're like, what the? How do you have Pokemon Gold? It's not even out yet. And it was like, <laughs> like a janky English translation. It was cool, though. Yeah, it's rad. I don't even know where he got it from. Where would you even get stuff like that? <laughs> yeah, I have no idea. It's like, um... Everyone nowadays, they're just like, oh yeah, the bootleg Pokemon Crystal with the... <laughs> I, I feel like it's probably the same thing. It's like those Pokemon Crystals. Those Pokemon Crystals. Yeah, that's what I said. Let me use my, use my special. I use my special on one guy. The Virtual Boy was a disaster, but it give, did give way to Virtual Reality. Yeah, the metaverse. Imagine if the metaverse was like the Virtual Boy Advance. Everyone would have severe eye strain. Oh no, get me out of here. Get me out of here. Here we go. It's good times. Good times. Okay, I should not have been there. Mark Zuckerberg. Yeah, that guy. You guys know Mark Zuckerberg. That's a guy. That's a guy who exists. He's real. What if he's actually not real? What if what if he's actually from the metaverse this whole time? He just he's so he's so adamant about everyone adopting the metaverse. Maybe it's because that's where he's from. Whoa. Never thought about this. him. He wants to make the metaverse real. He just yeah, he just wants to go home. Come on, think of him. Think of the mark. He's doing this for his home planet, the metaverse. The VR equivalent of come to Brazil. Yeah, maybe. If Brazil was like some... Wasn't there... There was like a report of like how... <laughs> the people developing like the metaverse, they don't even play it, right? There's a whole article about... They had like less than 30 concurrent users of like Meta, Meta Horizons or whatever. And they had to... They had to force people to play it. People developing it don't even want to use it. That's how you can tell it's good. It's good when no one wants to play it. It's to that's totally, that's totally what it is. Oops. Oh no. I'm not paying attention at all to what's happening on this stream. <laughs> I've just been. I should. I should play Turf War. This is basically. I'm playing this like I was playing Turf War. Whoop. 
Okay, okay. They did announce the, um... The new version of the meta quest. I hate that it's called that now. It's not the it's not the Oculus Quest anymore. They have like the Meta Quest Pro. It's like fifteen hundred dollars. It's like very targeted towards like not gamers, but professional users. People who want to use VR like as an office replacement, I guess. Like when I first got my VR headset, I tried using um, some of the productivity tools. I don't know why I said it like that. Productivity? The uh, productivity tools. <laughs> like using multiple monitors and like using your keyboard in VR. But I felt that it was kind of annoying. And I'm not sure if it's ready. I'm still waiting to, for Nintendo to port their Game Boy Advance games to Switch. Yeah, they should. There's like so many Game Boy games that were good. Like they had Game Boy games on the uh, the 3DS, right? I played some of those. You're just like I would like to play a Nintendo game legally, but they won't. They literally won't let me. <laughs> just they just don't let you do it. <clears throat> there was an apparent leak that says it was going to happen. Yo. Leaked information. Know, it's it's nice having like all these games to play because like like I've been playing a lot of uh, Mario Super Picross, and like if it wasn't for the Nintendo Switch Online, like it being a built-in game that you get, I probably would never have gotten into Picross. Whoops. It's the same leaker that says Bloodborne is going to be seen. Yo, it's real, Bloodborne. Wait, how? We won? Okay. I was not paying attention at all. Anyway, that's cool. Metroid Fusion and Kirby and the Amazing Mirror. There's like a bunch of Kirby games on the, the Game Boy Advance. Remember I played... Nightmare in Dreamland quite a bit when it came out. That was fun. I would play that again. Although that's actually just a remake of uh, one of the NES games. I probably could play it. But I won't. Okay, I'm just gonna play regular Turf War. Fusion is great. I've actually, I've never played any Metroid game. So I have no idea what they're like. They're pretty they're pretty well liked though. Everyone loves Metroid. Nightmare in Dreamland is better than Kirby's Adventure. Are they like inherently different? Like I know it has better graphics, but like Is it is it the same thing? I know it has it has like a Meta Knight mode. <laughs> Meta Knight mode. Oops. Uh, Kirby has 6 health, and then if you beat the game, you unlock Meta Knight, and he has 3 health. And that was cool. They're different in a few ways. Did I disconnect there? <laughs> no one else on my team is here. Am I disconnected? No. It's Zoe. Wait, I should I should use um I should use the thing. I should use the drink ticket. I think my switch is lagging. I don't know. <laughs> you guys seeing that? It looks like it's lagging. I don't know. Connection issues. Literally. Okay, okay. You know what? No, I will continue to use tower control. <laughs> Wait, I have three wins? That's cool. Let's see, the game doesn't lag every time there's more than two enemies on screen. Oh yeah, <laughs> the NES. They, I like how when they, like the games that are included on the NES, like Nintendo Switch Online stuff, they even have proper like 
they they also lag. It's like, whoa, it's like totally accurate. Love to have lag. What was the deal with Ninten Nintendo putting Super in front of all their existing franchises? I mean, it's because it was like on the, the Super NES, right? Wait, no, Super Mario Bros. Never mind. <laughs> Super Mario Bros. was... It was called that before the Super NES. The Super NES. But it's like uh, when the DS came out. And all the games had DS in the title. Okay, all uh, everyone on my team is dead. <laughs> no, we're fine. I should not have been there. Let's see, there's less random bowl with hitboxes and enemy placements. Did they they change the like enemy positions and stuff like that? I would have thought they would have kept that the same. But actually, I had no idea that it was actually. What what is? <laughs> I can't destroy that guy. Okay, all right. Oh yeah, Advance Wars. Advance Wars is fun. Wait, did, when is the Advance Wars remake coming out? Didn't they announce that forever ago, and then they had to like delay it because of like various wars? Is that is that coming out at any point? Did they did they have like an actual date for that? It was supposed to be released like at the beginning of this year's right. <laughs> And then they're just like, oh yeah, some wars are happening. They're like, well, there's always a war happening somewhere. You can't just keep delaying your game because of a war in the real world. Yeah, oh, too many <laughs> too many wars. It would be insensitive to to say that these wars are not advanced. The first one was delayed. Oh yeah, it was. So true. Oh, that war was so advanced though. I play that game a lot. Yeah, you can dab in this game. It's the it's the highest tier reward. You have to be you have to play this game a lot. To earn the ability to to dab. No, we don't call it advanced wars. It's advanced wars. There's no D at the end. Right? Did I, did I remember that correct? I I'm pretty sure it's Advance Wars. The naming scheme... Oh yeah. It was on the Game Boy Advance. So excited when Super Famicom Wars got a translation. Played it for 20 minutes. That was... Yeah, that was Advance Wars. But it's just a renaming. I mean... Advance Wars was just a renamed version of... Actually, I don't know. I don't know the history behind Advance Wars. I think a lot of people didn't like the, uh, the grim dark version. Like, the most recent Advance Wars. They did away with all the, like, fancy, uh, colorful stuff. And they put it in, like, a grim dark post-apocalyptic world. And people are like, oh, this sucks. This is an Advance Wars that I know. I thought it was still good. Yeah, I, I enjoyed it. It was much more balanced. If you look at, like, some of the... <laughs> some of the powers in the first game. Like, Eagle. You always play as Eagle. Literally... OP. And, uh, their powers are not as flashy. But that's good. That's actually good. Advance Wars, like Fire Emblems, is a franchise that existed since the NES era. Yeah. And how, like, no one in the, in the West knew about Advance Wars until Smash Bros. It's like, who's Marth? Oops. We're winning. I totally help my team. I'm totally helping somehow. Pretend that I'm helping my team. By 
of spamming my special. Okay, look at this. You have to dodge a Booyah Bomb and missiles? No way. Oops. Look at those dodges. Advanced dodge. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave. Okay, where's where the where are all the enemies? They have not spawned in yet. <laughs> oh, we're winning so much, they're just all dead. Nice, very nice. Let's see, when Advance Wars had their only rep and smash removed in the biggest game. Hey, was it was there some Advance Wars in the latest Smash Bros game? Wow. The only two Fire Emblem games I have are Three Houses and the one on NES. I've only played Fire Emblem Awakening. I think because at some point everyone was talking about it. You would see fan art all the time. And I actually didn't play it until like two years after its release. When it finally went on sale for the first time, I think. On the eShop. And I was like, oh, I, I know of this game. And then I got it. Yeah, everyone was like... Yo, oh, you can you can get married. You can, <laughs> well, you, you can have your waifu. You can you can ship people. They can have children. That's what made it popular. That's literally how it was marketed to me. Not not to me by Nintendo, but like, uh, I think it came out when I was in college, and one of the people in my senior projects group, he was really into that game. And I didn't really understand. He's like trying to explain the game to us. It's like, oh, you you have these units, and they can get married. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, all right. We're talking about Fire Emblem. Accidentally married MC to some random character. <laughs> Doesn't everyone get married to to Krom? Just because that's who you get by default. What am I doing? I like Fire Emblem until it became best shipping. No, you don't get it. You don't get it, man. You have the waifus. I don't know. I don't really care about Fire Emblem. Oh, look, I, I splatted someone. Oh, no, no, no. Steps. I remember reading a thing about how like in Fire Emblem, the percentages that they show, like your hit percentage, those are actually like exaggerated to make it more obvious whether something is more likely to happen or not. Because like I think a common thing is like in when people play XCOM and they see like a 95% chance, they're like, oh, there's no way this is definitely going to miss. But then I think in other games like Fire Emblem, the percentages are not, not actually accurate. They actually make it so that I don't know. I don't know. They exaggerate them. Who's the best waifu? I don't know. I don't remember anything. <laughs> I, I, I played Fire Emblem Awakening. I beat it. I don't remember anything about it. I have no idea. Everyone likes Lucina. Right? I don't know. Yeah, 90%. 90% of gamers. Oh, hey. Look at how much we're winning. I totally helped my team there. Definitely, for real. I probably have like zero kills. <laughs> no, I had, I had a, at least one. I had one kill. Later games started using real percentage. What really? I thought I thought they always exaggerated. How could they do this? Oh, I have two splats. Yo. That's, that's a pretty good. That's pretty good gear, probably. Yeah, I definitely was carried by my team there. <laughs> Two splats, everyone else on my team had at least seven. 
The only ones I can think of are Marth and Girl Marth. That's Lucina, right? <laughs> That's Lucina. It's Lucina, except... No, that, that is her, yeah. Krom. Do they have Krom in Smash Bros? Girl Mar Garth? Garth Brooks? Yeah, Girl Marth, also known as Garth. Garthfield? Okay, here we go. We're gonna win this one as well. Oh yeah, Krom is an assist trophy. Or something. Martha. Oh no. The bomb. Look, they have Marth. They got Roy. They got... Lucina. They got Lucino. Got Lucino's pizza rolls. The reckless safety man. Yeah, the Wii. Make sure you don't swing from side to side. Oh, don't shoot at me. I'm just a guy. How could they do this to me? I was just- I was just a guy. I'm literally just playing Turf War here. Yeah, they had Robin. Yeah, Robin was in Smash. Robin Hood. Oh, I should not have been on there. Welcome, Nutritious. Splatten is going okay. Okay, goodbye, Ian. There's a lot of people I didn't greet. People that showed up from the raid, I didn't greet anyone. <laughs> I usually greet people as they show up, but then I don't. There were- because there were too many people. Simply too many. Donkey Kong. Who's from- so Donkey Kong has Donkey Kong, Diddy Kong. Wait, yeah, Diddy Kong's there. Who's the third- oh, King K. Rool. Whoa, whoa. This guy is sharkin'. How can he do this? You can't do this to me. Don't you know who I am? And the guy who spams supers? <laughs> oh, come on. I should have just used it. Should have just used my super. There's so many games. They have like alts. They have supers. They have specials. You got spoopers. Alright, now we, we got him. We did not get him. Uh, they are very close to winning. Or getting a higher score than us. Okay, we have lost the lead. It's totally because I'm not helping my team at all. I'm just, I'm just dying a lot. It's fine. They understand. They, they understand that I'm bad at this game. Okay, <laughs> okay, just, just, just chill, okay? Just stop shooting at me. I'm literally just a kid. Okay, I'm dead. We're dead. Wow. Okay, who who is in Fire Emblem in Smash? They had... Okay, let me try to name all of them. Lucina. Barth. Roy. Robin. Ike. Um... Where are the other three? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Was there like a green haired one? Whoops, I didn't. I should not have stuck with the scene. They had, um. Marth Cena? John Cena? They have John Cena in Smash Bros. Had um, 
I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Whoever approved all the Fire Emblem characters. I remember playing Mugen a long time ago. Mugen. As a kid. I thought it was the coolest thing. But yo, you can have characters from different series. What? Literally unbelievable. And then they were, they was like, it's not balanced, right? Because <laughs> anyone can create their own character. So there's like no chance of it being balanced at all. It's cool though. Sometimes I see clips on my, uh, my Twitter. Just retweeted of like absurd things that you can do in Mugen. Mugen. So you can have Hatsune Miku fight Sans Undertale. Can you believe this? Oh, okay. Alright. Okay. Okay, we have been destroyed. I don't think we're gonna win this one. Because they seem like they're pretty good. And on the other side we have me, and I'm definitely not good. Alright, okay, let's use our special. What is it with Undertale? What uh, what about Undertale? Well, I got that guy somehow. <laughs> There's no way I could have I should have gotten that guy. Why does no one include But Sans on he is in Smash Bros. We got the me the me fighter. Just a quirky indie game. Oh yeah, it's always Sans. <laughs> it's never anyone else. When has Papyrus ever showed up in a game? It's always Sans. John Undertale. Where's Toriel, huh? Where's the, the king guy? The, the divorced guy? Where is the divorced man? What if, what if they added, like, uh, people that wanted Undertale representation in Smash Bros? What if they added, like, Napster Book or something? As, like, a playable character? I feel like Toby would do that, right? Just for fun. Like, hey, Toby, we would like to feature an Undertale character. Fans really love Sans. Could we put Sans in our game? Say no. Not as a playable character. You have to put Naps to book. You have to put the dummy, the training dummy. And then they do. Everyone rejoiced. Um, <laughs> I got him though. I wasted my special on one guy. Why is it never Muffet? I don't know. Was it Muffet? Muffet was like a like a fan design, right? Like when they had the Kickstarter, people could submit their own characters to be included. Muffet was one of them. Yeah. I knew I know the lore. And then she became the most popular fan submitted character. So true. So true. Um, I'm the only one alive. <laughs> this should not be happening. Okay, okay, get get out of here. Get out of here. I don't know why I went back so far. Maybe I should use a different weapon. Like this is this is just mindless gameplay at this point. <laughs> It's pretty cool. You learn something every day. Literally, that is your thing that you learned today. <laughs> okay, okay, get me out of here. Get me out of here. Okay, thank you. Thank you, teammate. 
you literally saved me as I was about to die. Okay, get them, get them. They will never get us. Okay, get me out of here. Oh, no. It's pretty cool to see how popular Undertale has become, though. Right? Just like some quirky indie game. And now, like, Toby Fox is like... He's friends with Sakurai or something. <laughs> what the heck? That's wild. It's cool, though. It's very cool. Like, I think Sakurai mentioned that... Like, he has a YouTube channel. And the... The people that do the translations are the ones that, <laughs> the ones that translated Undertale. And he got recommended them from, from Toby. He's making music for Pokemon. Yeah, true. Let's see, I've been using the un undercover umbrella for lots of inking. Plus it's got the umbrella shield. I've seen a lot of people using the blob lobber. It's, it's really annoying to avoid it. Wow. I have a friend who contributed to the Undertale Kickstarter before it became popular. And so his name is in the credits. Every time he sees a <laughs> every time he sees a VTuber play the game and they get to the credits, he always takes a screenshot of his name in the credits. He's like, look, it's me, it's me. Okay, that's cool. You can you can legitimately say you supported this game before it was popular. So true. I can say that I knew Temi before Undertale, huh? Can you guys say that? I can say that. Actually, you could say it. You can't verify it. Anyone could say it. But I'm saying it. Yeah, Bob Lobble. The Blob Lobber. They call it that because you lob the blobs. Yo, we got transfery on the team. There's no way we can lose now. I knew Undertale before Temi. Can I say that? No, I guess I can't say that. Oh no, I knew Temi before Undertale, so I can't say the reverse. Can't believe he got me with his logic. His facts, as well as his logic. SMH. Well, he became Spider-Squid. Spider-Man. Okay, there it is. We're winning totally because I helped my team. Oh no, okay, I should not be here. Ah, everyone is going after me. How was I supposed to win there? They got three people. Literally just one guy. Oh, okay. Just one guy. I knew about Temi from Cheesy. That's a name I haven't heard in years. I don't even remember what that <laughs> what that was. That was like a deviant art alternative. Wow. That was a long time ago. I'm gonna assume people still use deviant art. It was a less popular deviant art. I see. I think I had an account on there. Like a long time ago. It was like I was probably like 13 or 12 at the time. The first time ever hearing about it. It's like, whoa, you can upload art to a website for free? Like back then, you had to like. Everyone used like Image Shack and stuff like that. <laughs> Remember Image Shack? 
remember thing that existed in the 2000s? And then you had like bandwidth limits. So if your image became popular, you got replaced with like a photo of a frog. Photo bucket, yeah, there's a photo bucket, image shack, a bunch of other stuff. But you would buy your own hosting <laughs> to ensure your vid your your content was visible. Um, I guess I'll use my special on one guy. Is that why I always saw yeah the frog? It's always like you've exceeded your bandwidth limit. Here's a here's a frog. For real on God. Frog. Love that frog. Love that frog. It's one of the frogs of all time. Oh no. <laughs> Wait, huh? I got someone. I somehow got someone with that. Got them. Got them. There we go, using my special on one guy. Yeah, got them. Got them. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> got them. Okay, get out of here. Get out of here. Hey, I'm inking here. Okay, I'm shooting. I'm shooting things. Hope you guys are having a good day. An excellent day you have going on to today, right here. Whoa. What was I even talking about before this? I don't know. Fire Emblem? No one named the three Fire Emblem characters that I forgot. <laughs> Are there actually eight? Are there actually eight characters? The Smash Bros. from Fire Emblem. Okay, okay. <laughs> there's, a guy, there's a guy behind you. You named all- okay, I didn't- I didn't see it. I missed that comment. Look at this guy missing comments. Corin? Who the heck is Corin? Oh, they got Byleth. Wait, Chrom is playable? Oh wait, I guess you mean... ...of characters in general? Who's Corin? This is where you say Corin D's. Corin D's. Krom is playable? What? Is he? Corin. I'm gonna look it up. Fire Emblem. Corin. Oh yeah, I recognize this one. Playable character in Fire Emblem Fates? I see, I see. All right, I'm gonna hydrate. Okay. Yeah, Corin these apples. That's a thing people do, right? They core the apples. Or is it decor? Do they they remove the core, but that's called coring? Instead of decoring. Isn't decoring when you like do do like interior decor? Right? What's up? What's up with the words? How do words work? Microsoft Word. Decorating. 
when you rate the decor, I am decor rating right here. When they go and do things, I'm just I'm just saying words. This guy's out here saying words, shooting ink. I shot at only one person <laughs> because I fell off. Okay, all right. Let me get out of here. Let me get out of here. <laughs> I could not get out of there. What's everyone's favorite word? You guys have a favorite word? You know, people have a uh, least favorite word. Some people really dislike the word moist. What is what is it about the word moist? It makes people really dislike it. I had someone that I knew in high school, and she really disliked the word pronto. For some reason. I knew multiple people that did not like moist. What's up with that? Crumb? Yeah, crumb as in money. This is how this guy refers to money. Crumb? <clears throat> Shenanigans? That's a, that's a cool word. It's a funny word. There's like a word that's like a fear of long words. And that's, that itself is just like a really long word. That's only that way to make fun of people. Oh no, oh no. They're shooting things at me. Don't you dare. I got him. I got him though. We have taken the tower. It's a tower defense. Yo, Duck has the uh... There's the Noir Vesper emotes. I, s I saw you in the chat. At the end, using my clapping emote. I saw it. Yo, yeah, Lisp. 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 Lisp is also a programming language. What the... That's right, that's right, Noir Vesper underscore whole stars underscore en. That's how you know it's real. Because he has the name of the company on there. Hey, yeah, that's not the name of the company, that's the name of the, uh, the group. Whoa, there's a lot of, there's a lot of. Did they make the uh, the platform shorter? Like the uh, the tower, I mean. Like it looks like it's much shorter than it is in the other the other maps. What's going on here? Yeah, how is it so short? How do they make it so short? The music is bopping. They added a new vertical movement option, but also made everything shorter. Oh yeah, they added this thing. Oh, you can do that. And then I never use it. It's cool though. They added things to this game. I'm not even helping my team. I just fell off. <laughs> I literally just fell off. L. There's L plus ratio. Oh, hey, don't shoot at me. Why is he shooting at me? What did I ever do to them? To make them shoot at me? I can't believe I thought we were just having fun. I'm just having fun and you're shooting at me. Look at how fuzzy that guy is. Look at that cat. Look at this cat. Alright. 
I don't know how well I've been doing the past few games. I got five kills. That's that's probably that's probably good. Oh, I should not be in A rank. <laughs> I'm definitely not an A rank player. Just the fact that you can't rank down. It's kind of messed up. They're going to keep me in A rank until like three months from now. Fell off. Plus, I'm small. How is he so small? Oop. I could add the chibi tag to my Twitch tags. You got some streamers that don't put joke tags in their in their tags. Who can relate? All of my tags are just legit. And then you got people making up tags. Just putting random things in their streaming tags. Imagine, imagine doing that. Imagine using tags not as a categorization system. Just for fun, just to put jokes. You think this is some kind of joke? Tags? No. That's how Tumblr uses tags. Remember Tumblr? People would just put random comments in tags. And that was just how people used the site. You would have artists posting stuff. And then people check in the tags to see the actual comments. <laughs> Auto bomb. What? Isn't that the name of the highway? The auto bomb. Okay, they took the tower. They're taking the tower. Um, I guess I'll use my special. I should have waited until they respawned. Oops. They got two Splatana users. The validation of posting art and seeing people leave comments. Yeah, but then you have to like go to their blog <laughs> to click that. Sometimes when I used to post on Tumblr, I would like look at Look at the tags, and then there's people that actually use tags the way they're supposed to be used. Like, they, they would post it, and then it'd have, like... Hashtag art, hashtag figure drawing, hashtag whatever. It's like, what the? You don't mean, like, hashtag I love this piece, OMG, this person's so amazing, go follow them. They just have regular freaking tags. SMH. What am I supposed to make of that? People using tags without expressing any sort of opinion? Unbelievable. Don't they know the proper way to tag things? It's with something that doesn't correspond at all to something you want to look for in the future? Remember when Tumblr had the like button on the top? I don't remember this. I haven't used Tumblr in maybe like eight years. <laughs> Remember when Tumblr messed up their UI? Which time? Uh, all the times. <laughs> Remember all the times Tumblr messed up their like JavaScript and CSS? And allow people to post stuff and just have it overlap with other posts? I remember. Actually, one of my one of my coworkers from my previous company used to work at Tumblr, and he mentioned that the code base is actually super bad. I guess that's not surprising, but it's like it's it's like really bad. And I know someone who left our company and then he went to Tumblr, and I was just thinking like, man, that's like a bad idea. Their code their code is a a, a huge mess. In Tumblr now porn back on recently. I think I read something about that, you yeah. know. 
They saw it on Twitter. It was like trending on Twitter. It's like t Tumblr is trending on Twitter. <laughs> and then people are like, yo, you can you can put the porn. Tasteful <laughs> tasteful nudity, okay. But who's who's determining that? Who decides? Oops. Oh yeah, I guess I guess for like um like figure drawing reference and stuff like that. That kind of stuff. Maybe I don't know. You never know. I got two people with that. Somehow destroy two people. Who taste tests it? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Whoops. What is happening with Twitch anyway? Everyone is threatening to leave Twitch. All the big streamers. People streaming on YouTube now. Whoa, hey. Get them. Get these guys. <laughs> get me out! Get me out of here! I don't want to be there. Oh look, we did it! A good old Twitch, classic Twitch. They had like five different ways of monetizing. In some channels, you can do an elevated chat. Some channels, you can send bits. Still, <laughs> some channels you can send uh, coins. Wow, that's not confusing at all. Very strange. Very strange system they got. I had to opt out of the coin thing. This thing the plugins are just not built for it. Everything's still built around bits. Actually I'm also confused. Like some some channels they have it so that like instead of sending bits, you send just like money. But then, like, but then they still have, like, emotes that are hidden behind bits, right? Like, 1k bits, 10k bits, 5k bits. But if you, if you pay money with just, like, the regular money, you don't get the, uh... You don't get the emote, right? <laughs> Thank you for the, the sub, Mooneybug. Thank you. Yeah, just Twitch doing things. I still don't have access to moments, or whatever they call them. Like, Twitch has a feature called Moments now, where you can, like, if something cool happens in chat, you can create a moment. And then everyone who was there gets a badge. But I don't have that. What is this shade of yellow? <laughs> this is, like, the, the grossest shade of yellow I've ever seen in this game. What is this? <laughs> There's a green. Green slash yellow. Twitch Lord. What was it? What did it used to be? This is green. Do you know my monitor is messed up? Oops. That time when I said something was yellow when it was actually orange or whatever. <laughs> something was green. This is green? Okay. Oh no, get me out of here. Get me out! Where is everyone? Yeah, Nickelodeon slime. It's slime in time. Oh. Okay, we're winning though. Look at how much we're winning. It's all because I got those two guys at the beginning. My special. MVP, MVP Wolfie. The threshold used to be 100, now it's 50. Let's see, but that only really matters for like the smaller streamers, right? I guess it's still good. Yeah. That's how they, that's how they keep the money. That's how they lower their, uh, their credit card transaction fees or whatever. Wait, no, that's not it. They don't use credit cards to send you money. But it is due to fees, though. 
You have to pay a fee every time you transfer money. They would like to, to minimize those. Okay, I'm gonna go here. We got another Tenta Missiles user. <clears throat> Twitch does have payout fees. Also stopped streaming and I had $50 held hostage pretty much. No, but now you can get it. I fell off. <laughs> I just jumped off. Yo, Twitch. Twitch doesn't know how to get the money. They're paying Amazon too much for their server. <laughs> Amazon, the company that owns them. Or AWS fees. Think of the corporations, please. Please think of Jeff Bezos. Yo, I destroyed Burger King. Splatted Burger King. This guy is burgering and kinging. Load. Jeff Bezos. Jeff Bezos. <laughs> Literally starving. Yeah, think of think of this billionaire. We need to spend less money on storage space. More money on sending him into space. That's that's what that's what I've been saying. That's what that's what streaming's all about. No, it's fine. We're still winning. Look, we're winning so much. We are hashtag winning. Yep. Totally, totally winning. Wait, what, what has Jeff Bezos done recently anyway? Has he done anything? <laughs> He went to space, and then what? What does he do? Look at that guy, that guy was hiding. He thought he could trick us by hiding. He did, he did trick us. And then we got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got them. Wait, is he, is he in space? <laughs> did he ever come back from space? Didn't- wasn't he in space for like a few hours? He donated 700 million dollars? I mean, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool, right? It's a bunch of money. Wow. That's- that's more money than... Than I will ever see in my life. Yeah, why why doesn't he give like a just show up in a channel, give out like a billion gifted subs? What is his Twitch name? And I shout out <laughs> shout out Jeff Bezos. Something went <laughs> something went wrong when attempting to perform the shout out. Okay, you can't shout out Jeff Bezos. I tried just now. You literally can't. Let me do the <laughs> Jeff Bezos. Let me do the 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 fake shout out. Nope. Wait a second. This isn't even right. Check out Jeff Bezos. They were streaming at Twitch.tv. <laughs> Not even twitch.tv slash Jeff Bezos, just... He was just streaming at twitch.tv. Something's wrong here. <laughs> what is he- what is he doing? What are they trying to keep from us? What does his OBS layout look like? Thanks for the gifted subs, Jeffrey Bezos. 
Welcome, Loki. Um, where is everyone? Someone's trying to hide. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. Jeff Bezos. No one's showing up to Jeff Bezos' debut stream. Can we get 200 likes on this? Reveal. <laughs> Reveal Jeff Bezos' new live 2D model. He needs funding, please. Please, please think of Jeff Bezos. He wants to be an indie VTuber. He'll do it. It'll just be a bald man. New outfit reveal. Jeff Bezos. Okay, alright. Stop shooting at me. I'm not even on the objective. Wow. Yo, Robin? We were literally talking about Robin. From Super Smash Bros. Robin. Robin Hood. There it is. We're literally in this game. Well, okay. <laughs> oh yeah, Robin from uh, DC Comics. We got the real Robin in here. Robin also a type of bird. Did you guys know Robin is a bird? The boy wonder- yeah, what is he wondering about? What is the boy wondering about? One Direction? Wait a second. Is One Direction named that because, like, Wonder? No. Oop. Oh, no, get, get out of, get out of here. Robin, aw, oh, Robin. Jingle Bells. It's a wonder. Wait, did Robin's parents die? Is that is that what he has in common with Batman? Robin's parents were all, they also died. What the? Oh, I had I did not know <laughs> I did not know Robin's lore until just now. Why Batman adopts the first Robin? Oh yeah, right, yeah. Oh. Wait, there's multiple Robins? Is the Robin from Teen Titans the a different Robin? That multiple? There's at least four. Wasn't there one of them became like a uh, Nighthawk or something? I don't know. I don't know comic books lore. Nightwing. That's the first one? They tell me the first one isn't even... <laughs> doesn't even go by Robin anymore. That's the first one. The one from Teen Titans. Who are the other two? One of them went. One of them went on to to be in Fire Emblem. What, what's the fourth one? Whoop. Jason Todd. I have never heard of this one. He died, but God, he was resurrected. They're always doing that in comics. They have people dying and then coming back from the dead. Such a comic book moment. Oh, this is what they do. Just they just show up, they start dying. Then they come back. He's like, whoa, check it out guys. Just a joke. Just a joke. We never really die. The Red Hood? Oh, like Robin Hood? <laughs> Robin Hood. 
Third one, Tim Drake. From Uncharted. Drake. And Josh. Okay, so th there's four Robins, but... Are there multiple Batmans? Batman? There's just there's just one just one Batman adopting all the Robins. Damian Wayne. I've heard that name. I remember that. I know of that guy. What's everyone's least favorite superhero? <laughs> Batman Beyond. Oh yeah, I remember that. That was, uh, that guy. Yeah, that futuristic looking bad man. Like, this isn't Batman. It's just some other guy. Yeah, Batman Beyond. Okay. Oh, look at them. <laughs> They're all spawn jumping in here. Beyond me. <laughs> Beyond Batman? So you guys remember, there was like a online game called Beyond. It's like B-Y-O-N-D. I remember playing that. Or at least I tried to play it as a kid. Bringing back some memories. Beyond. I don't know if anyone remembers. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I just made this up. Maybe it's not real. Okay, there's a guy right here. Ah, oh, they're all over the place. <laughs> okay, they definitely won this one. I feel like we are being... Uh, we're about to be spawn camped. Yep, they got it. They got this. I've actually, I've never tried a Beyond Meat Burger. Are they good? Do they taste just like meat? Yeah, we, they had Sauce Man. There's no way we could have won. They had Sauce Man. The reincarnated world champ. What? No, I, how am I the number one overall splatter? With four splats? There's no way. What? Okay, I tied with everyone. That's not possible. How could they do this? How could they do that to me? You can tell if I'm the number one top splatter... The team is probably not that good. Oop. Look at these jump shots. He's jumping and shooting. Toxic. No, this is like self-deprecation. I guess that that is also toxic to yourself, I guess. Self-deprecation. Toxic to oneself. No. Toxic fallout. Is it? Isn't it? Uh oh, uh oh. Cancelled for being toxic to yourself? Look at this guy. Self deprecating humor. I believe this guy. Write, write the twit longer. I'm sorry about these negative things I said about myself. Whoa, okay. Wow, we destroyed them. Good job, team. Good, good teamwork. We are truly doing some work.
Now we're the ones spawn camping? Oh, how the tables have turned. I feel like I, I hear, pe hear more people say the turns have tabled nowadays. Just like, as a joke, to be ironic. No one ever says the normal way. And I also hear more people say commit Sudoku than whatever the actual thing was. Isn't it an office reference? No, people are just saying it. Oops, where am I? Off so close. How the turns have tabled. Oh no, no, don't shoot at me. Don't shoot at me. Gen M. Gen M. No, the office. You know, when people say the office, they always mean the American office, right? There's like the original UK version. People always mean the US one. Imagine, imagine the UK. How could they take the tower from us? We're doing okay. British humor. Look, you wouldn't understand. Okay, they're they're self-deprecating. That's that's what that's what they do. That's why it's funny. Because if you can't laugh at yourself, who can you laugh at? Others. That's what it is. Others. You can laugh at others. Actually, most of the time you're laughing at others. What the? Okay, okay. British humor, more like, more like, um, the cuisine, am I right? Toast sandwich, bean sandwich, who needs humor when you got that? The jokes write themselves, oh look at that. Doing pretty well here. Wait, where are, where are we were that close to winning? Wait, no, the, the other team. Sorry, I was looking at that one. It's like we were only. No, wait, no, we are only three. We were only three away from winning. Okay, get me out of here. Um, yeah, do that. What happened? Oh no. They are pushing the cart. Hey, I got the- <laughs> somehow got someone with that. Every time I get a splat, I'm always surprised. That should not have happened. And yet it did. No, my special it was charged. It was charged. Charged. Okay, no, nah, we we got this. This might go into overtime. Nope. Nope. Alright, good games. Those were some good games. Amazing. I was the record score setter and the number one checkpoint breaker. And look at that, the real victory was the fact that we dropped zero frames today. Wow. Has the curse been lifted? 
I know at the beginning of the stream we were like, don't jinx it, don't jinx it. But look at that. Zero drop frames. 0.0%. 0 .0%. Okay, well that's going to be it. Um, let's see what, what day today is. Why is this audio playing from my... <laughs> Oh, because I never changed. Okay, you know, okay, that's why. ISP getting. No, I'm already paying too much. Okay, let's see what today is. National Fetch Day. Fetch. Stop trying to make that happen. Sweetest Day. Bridge Day. Commemoration Day of King's Father. Global Hand Washing Day. International African Penguin Awareness Day. I like that one. Rural. We got National Cheese Curd Day. Um. National Latino AIDS Awareness Day. What? Lemon Bar Day. Mushroom Day. World Students Day. Okay, which one? Which one? Which one will we do? Um, hand washing day? Is there a hand washing emote? National hand washing day. Wait, was it global? Global hand washing day raid. And let's look at who's streaming. Who shall I raid today? Ragi streaming. But I've already raided Karagi recently. Let's see, let's see. Let me check. Let me check who I have not raided recently. Let's see, I've raided KK Cyber recently. September 17th. Yeah, that's right. I'm looking at my logs. I started keeping <laughs> keeping notes of who I've raided. Okay, let's see. Um, I've raided... I've raided Chenna on September 30th. Hmm. Oh wait, Lone Star Cult. Lone Star Cult, it's his... What is it? Second year anniversary. Okay, let's raid him. Let's raid. Spreadsheet. It's not a spreadsheet. I'm too good for spreadsheets. It's a log seek documents. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll be back on Monday, probably with more for Cross. And then after that, I'll have to figure out what else to play. Because I beat three Mario games last week. What am I gonna stream? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Yes, goodbye. Have a good rest of your Saturday and also Sunday. Now beat the all-star version. What is there's like Super Mario... What is... The lost levels? I don't know. Maybe I'll buy a game. Consider purchasing a video game. Um, Stray? Hey, Stray is on sale. The game with the cat. But I feel like too many people have played that game. Stray? Y'all heard of this game? Stray? Okay, goodbye. So true.